God. Welcome back to Earthbound. Let's play Fart. <laughs> okay. Fart 40. No. Welcome back to Let's Play Earthbound. Part 45. My name's I Like Being Smart. This is a robot. Clumsy robot at that. And we are going to, uh... Come on! Thank you. We're gonna use a bomb here. No! I don't want to use... Oh! Fudge. We're gonna use a bomb. But I'm gonna save the, uh... There we go. It's more important to save SSOH. Thought I had a cut. Oh, there we go. You know, I think I'm just gonna leave Jeff dead during this fight. Because it's going to be easier if he does that big attack again. Baloney sandwich, really? Yeah. Because if he does that big attack again, it's going to be very hard to save Jeff. But it'll be easy enough to save SSOH. And here's why. Because you can pull beta whenever you want because of the scrolling HP. Yes. See? See? I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. Sometimes. Not all the time, but there are times where I actually do know what I'm doing. Are you serious? Oh, come on. I know it would be easier with Jeff, but I just feel like... There you go. All of a sudden, some guys rushed into the room. The Runaway 5! This is why you need to get the Runaway 5 out of the Chipola Theater before you go in here. Lucky quickly ducked behind the robot. I flipped the switch and it stopped. <laughs> oh, jeez, what a loser robot. So easy to stop. That was quick thinking. Stop moving. I think you get a decent amount of experience, too, which sucks. Yeah, it's a decent amount of experience. Life of Gamma. That is good. That is very good. Okay. Now... Well, wait, I think we get healed in the next room, if I remember right. Let's talk to some of the Runaway 5 members here. We'd like to pay you back. We'll help them whenever we can. The room next door seems suspicious. Okay, let's go in it, then. Stop! That's enough! Please stop! I give up! I really do! I knew it! I'm so glad I saved that couple life noodles. I... I don't know. I think the last time I played through this on SNES, I healed up right there, and then I got healed. So don't heal up right there. Look at my skinny arms and body and gray hair. I've become so weak since I lost the Manny Manny statue. I'm sorry I kidnapped Nikki. I haven't done anything to hurt her. She's such a nice girl. I concur. Nikki, return to SSOH. I'm sorry I've created so much trouble for you. SSOH, you finally made it here. I'm fine. I believed you'd come and save me. Mr. Montoli isn't really a bad person. Take some time to listen to him. We got Nikki back! Yay! I'm finally back. After being gone for a few parts. Unfortunately. Oh, wait. There's more cutscene shit. Okay. I'll tell you everything. The Manny Manny statue creates an illusion. It attracts evil spirits and weakens your heart. The power scared me so much, I hid the statue in the warehouse at Jackie's Cafe. I often went there to pray. Cryptic words appeared to me while I was in the illusion. SSOH, your name appeared in the cryptic messages. Stop SSOH and do so by your own hand, or don't let them go to Summers, or make sure they know nothing of the pyramid. I don't fully understand the messages, but someone obviously doesn't want you to go to Summers evil Gygus or something? I could hear the name. Anyway, the evil side would be in trouble if you visited Summers. Oh, on the contrary, you definitely should go to Summers, especially because they don't want you to make it there. Would you like to... No, I don't want to hear the story again. 
Summers is located across the ocean. Take my helicopter. I'll open the door to my heliport. Heliport! Now, haven't we already established by this point I can't do electrical beast impressions? You must go on, SSOH. This is your destiny. Nikki, it's time we said goodbye. Take care. However, we're, uh, she's a little under level now because we just went through. Wait. Did we pick up the vitality capsule? Yeah, we did. We're gonna give it to her then because she only has nine. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> yeah, double digits is good. So let's go up here. More creepy music. <clears throat> All right, let's use the hell. Uh, what? What the? Pokey, that jackass! This is only you pinheaded idiot. You're just a half step too slow. I'm getting out of here. Since Monotoli has become a plain old man again, I have no more use for him. This helicopter will really come in handy. Looks like you're the world-class loser again. So great. How the hell do we get across the ocean when we don't have a helicopter? Oh, okay. Well, let's talk to Mr. Monotoli and see if he has any ideas. Pokey took the helicopter. I hope he's okay. That's all you have to say? Are you serious? Ah. What? What did you think of me? Ooh, I was a little dizzy, but now I'm okay. To get to Summers, we need to go back to Threed. Yep, somehow I know that's where we must go. Wow, you guys did a lot while I was in the bathroom. <laughs> you want to get to Threed as soon as possible? We can take you to Threed in our tour bus. I'll get the bus and wait for you just outside the building. We have teleport now. We could probably get there faster than with the tour bus, but... Eh, they're off in a free ride and it's kick-ass music, so I'm not going to object. And if that means I'm not going to object, you're not going to. Thereby, I win. <laughs> it always comes back to winning. Or is it dad? Oh. Hello, how are you? This is Apple Kid. I think I'm a real genius. In fact, I know I'm a genius. Why? Well, I have discovered the primary enemy of you and all humanity. We have to fight and defeat this being. To do so, we need to invent a machine called the Phase Distorter. I've got to find the wandering scientist, scientist Dr. Endonuts, and make the distorter. So I may be gone for a while. Later. Okay, sure. So, Dr. Andonuts and Apple Kid are going to be hanging out together. Are you a friend of the Runaway Five? Would an autograph be asking for too much? Yeah. I don't mean your autograph. Aww. Uh, you're not famous enough, SSOH. I'm sorry. Your autograph isn't worth anything yet. What was that glitch with the elevator there? That's weird. No, you are, technically. Those people go crazy. Crazy for Seamus now. It's crazy. This elevator's going down. Don't stare at my hips. It's true, man. What the hell is... <sighs> anyway. I don't know what that is. Um, I think we might have time to get to three, and then we will stop. Yeah. All right, let's talk to him. Plus, it's free, too. All right. All right, next time on Let's Play Earthbound, part 46. Wow, part 46. Uh, we're going to go back to Threed and see what we need there that's going to uh, 
help us out. 